While new tonight, the Centers for Disease Control has offered more guidance on mask safety. And folks, masks are not all created equal. Erica Proffer breaks down the differences in material and how they're made. A call between the Centers for Disease Control and the medical community show a lot of you have questions around these masks, such as cloth masks with exhalation valves. Are they safer to wear? CDC says no. The exhalation valve on respirators acts like a rifle barrel. So it shoots air that you're breathing out directly at what you're facing, and that's exactly what we don't want. Doctor said a simple cloth fabric does well enough. Just remember to cover your nose and your mouth. As for those carbon and HEPA filter mask claims. The cloth coverings are simple barriers. They're, they're there to block the sprays and droplets that you're producing when you speak. They're not necessarily intended to be filters. However, antiviral materials may become a thing. Just a word of caution. There's nothing wrong with doing that as long as those treatments don't create problems for the person wearing the cover. The effectiveness is not about inactivating specific viruses, but really containing the respiratory droplets that we otherwise release when we talk or cough. On comfort, folks ask the CDC about acne. Any fabric combination that feels good against your face and blocks the droplets that you're breathing will be fine. Ideally, it's something that is launderable so that you can pop it in the washing machine and then uh, dry it in a nice hot dryer to sanitize it between uses. They summed it up with this. Is it breathable, launderable, and is it comfortable? I'm Erica Proffer.